Empty shelves and price increases, that's what you'll see right now in the stores. Experts say the nationwide supply chain shortage won't be ending anytime soon. But what is it looking like right here in central Texas? 25 News reporter Austin Walker has more. The national supply chain shortage is being felt right here in central Texas from people just trying to pick up a few things at the store to even businesses just trying to serve. Walking into any grocery store, this is what you'll find. Lots of empty shelves of things like paper towels, cups, cleaning supplies, and even lunch meat. Once in abundance, but now it's like we traveled back in time to the start of the pandemic. Similar situations of scarce products leading to panic buying. And again, business owners are taking a hit. Brian Brown, owner of the backyard in Waco, says he's felt these effects for months. He says the price of cups have quadrupled, meaning what he used to spend on cups for the entire year, he's spending in just three months. And it's affected the bottom line, and we hold on as long as we can. I mean, we, we've, we've avoided price increases so for the most part, but it's getting to the point where... You'll have to kick up a little bit. With price increases on the horizon, concerns over federal policy has large retailers up in arms. Some fear President Biden's December 8th mandate to lay off employees who refuse to get vaccinated for COVID-19 will just keep the shelves empty. It's not just grocery store items and service products in high demand. Things like chlorine and microchips are also on a shortage. Now, experts say this is expected to last a lot longer. So they say the next time you go out to buy something at the store, shop smart. Reporting tonight in Waco, Austin Walker, 25 News.